guys welcome to the channel we are in Rowansburg Ohio and we're at Rowansburg Cemetery and we're gonna get in here directly and see what we see there's our glory flying in there beautiful as ever awesome and here's the old church I'm assuming that the cemetery goes with but is that not cool guys I don't know when it was built but that thing is old and it goes on up to the cross at the top. There it is. We're gonna get in here and see what we see, guys. It's down in here. We're gonna go see. All right, hang on. All right, guys, this looks like the newer part of the cemetery up that way. We will not be going that way. We will be going the other way. So we're gonna hit on what we can. That's going this way. There's one that died in 1884. Thomas, he died in 1896. I don't know that name, so I'm not going to say it. Lucy died in 1924, and Mary died in 1925. All right. Here's a good-looking stone. Someone died in 1889. That's the only one that's on it. Here's one flipping. Cyrus, he died in 1882. He's the only one that's on it. All right. Let's get these right here. They look like you can see them good. John, he died in 1877. Francis died in 1866. Uh, Lydia died in 1868. Or Charles died in 1875. And that stone slid over and it fell over. All right, we got this little section done. Let's go this way. The one coming up is going to be uh, uh, Army, and he's going to be uh, right here, Civil War, right there. Then you got one of these stones, Walter, he died in 1890, and let's see if anybody else is on there. I think he's going to be the only one on it. Yep, he's the only one that's on it. All right, that's easy enough. You're probably not going to be able to read that one. No, we ain't going to be able to. Here's Mary. She died in 1917. There's John. He died in 1901. Here's Jane. She died in 1906. Here's Harvey. He died in 1893. And here's Jenny. She died in 1882. Here's Frank, he was in the U.S. Army, World War II, and I bet here's his wife, right here. She died in 1923. Here we got one that died in 1919. I can't tell on this one, so we'll move on. One recently buried, another one recently buried. We're gonna leave that alone. <laughs> Whoop. And I'm tripping over one. It's laying sideways like that. 1906 on this one, but you can't read the name. We got a John. He died in 2001. He was World War II. Here's the Civil War. Another John right here. Then you got Richard, he died in 1926. Well, Ka Kathleen died in 1924. Took me a minute to see that one. Then you got one that died in 1950. And you got Calvin, he died in 1926. Then you got uh, William. He died in 1914. Then you got, whoa, ground's uneven. Then you got John here, he died in 1892. And his wife says she's still alive. Uh, we'll get this one. 
This one just slid up forward off its base. Died in 1940. Hold on one second, guys. Let's see if we can slide it back. There we go. Back where she belongs. And we'll move on. Rhoda died in, I want to say, 1909, but I can't see for sure. All right. Uh, I don't know about that one. Someone died in 1931, is all I can tell. Uh, we'll get this one right here. This is a cool looking stone. That's an awesome looking one. It's hard to see them clear, I mean, them lighter ones like that, though. There's another one that's just slid out. It's an infant. Uh, well, no, it ain't. No, it ain't. I took that back. Here's another one slid back. Now, I don't think I can move that one. Let's try. Yeah, I can too. A little bit. Hold on, guys. There we go. There's another fix. Awesome. All right, let's move on. Here we got this one. Right here is the name. And we'll get this flat one right here. I just happened to run across this place, seen a church, and just decided to come over this way. And here's a cemetery. So we were gonna hit it. We always do the cemeteries when we find them. There's another one that just laid down. Then we got one that died in David. Looks like he died in either 1903 or 1993. I'm not sure. And there's the rest of it down through there, guys. And he was Civil War. Then we got one in here. And around right here. All right. Not a real lot of old stones. So I'm just passing through them. And we'll grab some here and there. Awesome. And that one right there we just done. He's a Civil War. A lot of Civil War people. And they're buried everywhere. Here's Jerry Johnson. He died in 1891. Here's another Jerry Johnson. Well, no, wait a minute. Yeah, it says he was born in 1840 and he ain't died yet. Might be a son. I don't know. That one's leaning pretty bad, too. It's going to fall. I can't fix that one. Here's Rachel. She's the wife of Jerry Johnson. But she died in 1914. Here's a good looking stone. Another John. This is John Byrne. He died in 1999. I mean 1899. The next one coming up. He's going to be Civil War. He was the Army. And right here he is. And down there is his placards. All right. Let's see who we got here. I ain't sure. I'm not going to say. In 1924, I do know Simon's name. He died in 1930. I mean, yeah, 1930. All right. Not gonna be able to see that one too well. Uh, might see that one. Here we got the cool little stones I like. Got a beautiful design, but unable to read it. Looks like it's broke off and they just put it back in the ground. Here's this one. We got another. Here's the back side of that one monument. Probably read it better. There it is, guys, right there. Here's one. Boy, it's sliding slowly off its base. See how far it's moved over? Somebody must move that back before it fell. One person can't do it. This one died in 1877. It's an infant. And that's the only one that's on that marker. Here's a good looking stone. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to see it or not. But there it is, good looking stone. All right, here we go. This one's gonna be I'm going to say Civil War, so let me look and see. Yes, it's going to be Civil War. Right here. That one right there. It's going to be a Joseph, but I can't see the last name. And the top of it says Murray. 
so maybe she's married to Joseph I'm not sure but there it is here we go with this one and this one's gonna be hard to see for the flowers but right in there it is guys I don't want to beat the flowers down just to get the stone this one died in 1815 and Civil War veteran all right let's land on a couple of these Clara died in 1957. Uh, I'm not sure on the name, so we'll just say 1957. Minnie, 1941. And I don't think you're going to be able to see those. But Howard died in 1907. This is going to be another military. It's going to be World War II. Right here, Lloyd. He died in on May the 25th, 1988. We'll go ahead and get these two, since we can see them. Here's the mother. She died in 1918. Here's the father. He died in 1952. And here's their last name, right here. All right. Let's see what we got right here, guys. Oh. We got a Mary that died in 1898. We got, uh, I can't see the name. They died in 1900. Here's another one's flipped off. And this is a veteran. Hold on one second, guys. I'm gonna try to see if I can pick this one back up. So just give me just a second. All right. All right, guys. We got it back. There it is. There it's back on. There it's back to where it belongs, stood in that mud right there. All right, let's move on. They're frozen to the ground, some of them. So, we got him back together. All right, here's a cool looking one. I don't know if you can see it or not. There it is. Look at this big one, guys. That's a nice looking stone. And that's going to belong to right here. Here. In here then we got this down and someone died in Martin died in 1876 and then Catherine died in 18 no, 1895 and I think that's it and then we got this one and we got this one all right, then you got this one. It's a good looking stone, but it's so faded. But it's right in there, I don't know if you can see it or not. They died in 1886 or 96 one. And then there's another one right here and it's flipped and it's a beautiful stone. He died in 1911 and it's gonna be another John. Wow. I can't pick that one up, guys. Sorry. All right. Let's go ahead and get this over here. I ain't got much more on this side. We'll be to the other side. You got another John. He died in 1880. And he's the only one that's on there. And you got Francis. He died in 1894. Then you got, I can't tell if that's C.D. E.D. Ward. He died in 1884. He's the only one that's on there. Okay, here's the next stone beside him. I can't see the name on this one, but they died in 1887. Here's Mary. She died in 1923. Here's the 
uh, Esther or something like that. Died in 1913. Excuse me, guys. All right, let's see who we got here. Frank, he died in 1918. And Mary, his wife, died in 1927. And he is a Civil War veteran. All right. Here's another veteran. You ain't gonna be able to read it. But that's a veteran stone right there, too. And I'm not sure who it is. Here's an infant. Died in 1908. And I can't see that one, guys. Sorry. Here's another John. He's going to be Civil War. And he died in 1921. Mary, his wife, she died in 1921. And the one on the bottom... I can't really see that well, but they died in 1907. All right. Oh. Then you got a Jacob. He died in 1889. Harriet died in 1893. There's a church bell going off. That's cool. Here's another John. Says he's still alive. So that would make him pretty old now. Because 59 would be 100 years. So he's about 130 some years old. And here's his last name, Moore. And he's, evidently he was married to Mary, I mean Lois, but she died in 1915. All right, let's move on. Oh. Here we go. Right here, one died in 1877. One died in 1889. Then you got this big old stone here. Somebody died in, it looks like maybe 1890. I'm not sure. That one's leaning pretty bad too, like it's going to fall. And this one died in 1891. William. Alright guys. Now we're down to here. Father and mother. This one, I can't tell. I, I, I can't say because I can't read it that well. Can't see it. That's the kind of stone hard for me to see. There it is. All right, this side is pretty well knocked out. Let's go to the other side. Oh, wow, that's the first one of them I've seen that looks like that. They they're usually not made like that. That one's cool. That is awesome. This one died in 1883. Cashy. And is that the only one that's on it? It's going to be the only one that's on it. That is a beautiful stone. 1883 right there. That is an awesome looking stone. Look at that, guys. Those are pretty. All right. There's one. We'll hit on it. It's a good looking stone. W.M.W. Harris. He died in 1910. Let's move on. Here's another John. He died in 1935. This stone's got a lot of radiant on it. Oh, let me go down where you guys can see. Sorry about that. You know, it's even on this side. Wow. Usually you don't have that much writing on the one like that. But there it is. All right. Let's move on, guys. Ain't got too much more. That's a real good looking stone there. You can read that one real good. Margaret died in 1849. Uh, John died in 1866. And Mary died in 1882. That is a really good looking stone. And there's a little building. I don't know what it's for. It's at the back of the little cemetery. But we'll move on. Here's another good looking stone. You can read pretty good. It's another John. He died in 1862. Then you got Francis. She died in 1883. And then you got Catherine. She died in 1855. And that's it on that stone. All right. Then you got this one. Jacob died in 1901. 
Sophia died in eight. Wait a minute. Sophia, wife of Jacob, died in 1898. 1898. Okay. Took me a minute to, because I was seeing Sophia and then the wife of, and I was like, wait a minute. Here's another John. He died in 1910. Clara, she died in 1893. And I don't know what that middle name is. I can't pronounce it. I'm not even going to try. She died in 1921. Ones I don't know, I'm not going to try to pronounce because I don't want to butcher the name. Here's a really good looking stone. And they're a veteran. And he's a mason as well. There's a good looking stone, guys. All right, here's an infant. Right here, died in 1910. Here's another, Jacob. He died in 1905. That's a really pretty looking stone right there. And look at this big one, guys. That is humongous. Especially for this little tiny cemetery. And that's going to belong to these people right here. And I don't know if I can slide that one over or not, but I'm going to try just in a second, guys. So I'm probably going to sit you down for a minute while I try to move it. So hang on, guys. While I try to slide this stone over. Give me just a minute. Well, that's about as good as we're going to be able to get it. But we did get it moved some. So, there it is, guys. That's the best we could do. But it's back somewhat on its concrete and out of the dirt. So we'll move on. All right. All right. Here we go, guys. Oh, we're not going to be able to... Well, that's the mother says it's gonna be these guys right here she died in 21 he died in 1903 and he's gonna be Civil War and he's the father all right this next stone we're not gonna hit on because somebody has recently died and they're buried them so we're gonna move on and leave that alone but I have to go right behind it because we got Jerry here he's US Army World War II he died in 98 all right. It's been three open graves here. Had a lot of deaths lately. You got another Jacob. He died in 1892. And his wife, Ann, died in 1903. Oh, man. Here's one that's recently flipped. And there ain't no way a man can pick that up. You'd have to have about three or four people to pick that one up. But here, we'll move on. Ain't nothing I can do about that. One. Ain't going to be able to see this one, I don't think. Yeah, it's right here. They died in 1873, David, right there. That is a big old stone, and that's a veteran too. That's a, he was army, and it's gonna be a civil war. And I'll land on it right here. It's probably gonna be his wife instead of him. But there it is. He's gonna be down in the dirt on the other side. Yep, it's flat down on the other side, guys. I can't pick it up, or I would. All right, let's move on. Here's the next one. It's gonna be Richard. He died in 1895. And then his wife, I ain't gonna even try to pronounce that name. She died in 1891. We've just got a few more. Here we go. Who we gotta have here? We gotta have Abraham. He died in 1886. Then you got his wife, Mary. She died in 1892. Good looking stone. You can see them black ones when they're like that. They're really easy to read. Then you got right here. I'm just going to let you read that one. That's a big one right there. All right, let's move on. Here we got Jess. He, excuse me, guys. He died in 1913. And then his wife died in. 1951. Uh, let's get these right here. 
Someone died in William. He died in 1848. Then you got Nancy. She died in 1913. I don't think we're going to be able to read this one. Let's see. It's going to be right in here, guys. And you ain't going to be able to read it. All right, we'll move on. And then you got another David. He died in 1896. That's a good looking stone right there. All right. And we got a few veterans. But we ain't gonna be able to read it. One's gonna be right here. One's gonna be right here. And they're gonna be Civil War. Then you got a good looking stone right here, but the tops broke off, see it? And I don't even see it around, so it's gone. And he's gonna be Civil War. And that's gonna be Adam. He died in 1880. And his wife died in 1874. I think they're going to be the only ones that's on there. Yep. Well, no, you got a William here. Uh, I can't see it. But there it is, guys. Then we got one here. It's so far in the ground you can't even see. Then you got Anna. She died in 1926. Uh, let's get this one. Peter died in 1892. David died in 1928, and I can't see for the sun, but I think someone died in 1880 or 80s, I don't know, 90. I can't really tell the glare of the sun on that one. Then you got John, he died in 1899. These we ain't gonna hit on. We are gonna do it. These two right here. And this one has sunk in. I ain't, can't do anything with it because it's where I can't slide it over, I don't think. Give me just a second, guys, and I'm gonna see what I, if I can do anything with it at all. I don't know that I can, but I would at least try. So give me just a second. I'm gonna try to lay the camera down somewhere hopefully you guys won't see my ugly mug in the picture because that's not what it's about I gotta try to get my hand under it oh, man that's more of a job. We're going to go a little further. Get it up out of the mud. There we go. It's out of its hole. And it's level and it's back on the concrete. And that one's been sunk for a while, guys. Look at that. But he's back up level on the concrete area. The grass is still growing up around the concrete, but it's back up. Let's move on. There's one that died in 1817. Andrew. There's Catherine. She died in 1881. Peter. 1867, I want to say. There's another Catherine. She died in 1838. I can't tell on that one. I can tell someone died on, it looks like 1827 on that one. And, excuse me, guys. All that stuff to build up on me. Oh, ain't gonna be able to see on this one. It's gonna be right in here. And it looks like a Mary or a Nancy. No, it's five letters. 
maybe a guinea. I'm not sure. But there it is. And then he got a looks like a Michael on this side. He died in 1886. And then we got a few veterans here. We're gonna hit on over here. Here's Daniel. He was the Army Air Force World War II. He died in 1962. I got a, about five right here, and I'm gonna go ahead and do them real quick before I end the video. Here's another one, World War II. Daniel, he died in 1962. Here's Frank, he was US Army, World War II. He died in 2003. Here's World War II. Howard, he was US, US Army. He died in 1986. Here's William. He was a sergeant in the US Army, World War II. He died November the 8th, 2011. He has a bronze star medal. Very cool. And then we have Roger Roberts, US Army, World War II, 2004. All right, guys, I'm going to end the video because all this is newer, and I don't want to keep ending up on newer ones. So please share, share, like, subscribe to the channel if you ain't subscribed. And thanks for watching. Hit that like button on the way out. I'd appreciate it. And peace. I'm out of here.